Welcome back to Operation Pixel. Yes, welcome. We're doing more Golden Suns. Uh, oh, no, 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 no. You want to go up there uh, yet? Do I? Yeah, I think I'll be all right. If, if it does something does happen. Okay. But I think I have to move things. It does appear that way. So the last room was the, uh, the soul, the solar room, the lunar room. Yeah, soul and Luna, you found the, the rooms. Ah! <laughs> What's happening? Ron must have found something! Oh my! Uh-oh. Stop! You're about to make a big mistake! No! <laughs> Wait, Ron! You should just keep pushing them. What's wrong, Craven? Everything! This is the most interesting mechanism you found, Ron. But this is clearly some kind of trap. Clearly. Clearly. <laughs> this is a trap? Are you stupid? Go look in the Ruru room and you'll see for yourself! I'll stay here and look at this craziness! I'll study because I'm a scientist. But you've done well. Finding this means you're looking in the right place. But if you just move on one statue, you'll be caught in the Sanctum's trap. But why would anybody put a trap here anyway? Shut up! The only character I, I have is like did it. the least talk. <laughs> but they've hidden something very important. Perhaps they've hidden the key to alchemy itself. Yes. <laughs> it's Yoda now. <laughs> should I tell you more? Tell you more? Should I? No. <laughs> huh? Well, even if I told you now, you probably wouldn't understand. We must try to find a solution to this mystery. I like the idea of him saying that really condescendingly, like, even if I told you now, you you probably wouldn't understand. <laughs> oh, I I'll keep my checking line. the Luna room. You continue exploring the Soul Sanctum. I'll stay here in this place where electricity started flying everywhere. <laughs> my intuition tells me the light must be the key to the secret. We should test it. Yes. You do realize he just said that you push only one, you're in trouble. Ron, let's see if we can figure this out for ourselves. Let's go pushing more things. And we have four people here. Why can't we just push all four at once? Right? I think... Oh, yeah, okay. I'm, I think I'm going to go. Think... Are you Wait, no! <laughs> <laughs> oh. Just triggering traps for fun now. <laughs> it moves back, too. Yep. Let's push this one. What does this button do, as they say? Absolutely nothing. Actually, what I gotta do is this, I think. Uh, oh, no, you okay. probably gotta move both of them and then it, like, does something in that area. Um, there we go, that's it. Oh, yeah, there you go. Sort of. Well, I couldn't push it because I couldn't get behind yeah, it. Yeah, of course. No, I know, I get you. So now I gotta push this little booger. And what will this do, I wonder? We'll make Kraden scream. <laughs> Wait! <laughs> <laughs> you just caused that statue to drop. Priceless statue. You ever wonder, like, when people are designing these puzzles, right? Like, imagine the ancients who built this place. Yeah. And they're like, let's make it so that the statue falls down there. And they're like, how, how do we reset the puzzle afterwards, though, for, like, the next people to come or whatever? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> It's like the same as like a falling falling boulder trap, right? It's like it only works once. Yeah. The next person who comes is like, huh, I thought there'd be a trap here. Yeah, right. And then like the one person will die. Mm -hmm. And then maybe they might go through like five different people. Mm -hmm. But sooner or later, all the traps are going to be disarmed, yep. right? Yeah, you, you find like a poison dart trap. It's like, well, guess it fired all its poisonous arrows already. And yeah. And then you're like, oh, the fire traps. Just, oh, just... it's, it's out of gas. Or I'll just I'll just go inside inside this uh, this tomb here and just seal everything. <laughs> you just walk through and it's like, wow, I'm really glad eleven people came here before me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I might be the only one that survives this. <clears throat> oh, we're missing dialogue. Oh, I left it on the screen for a bit. Mmm, good work. <laughs> but I'm sad. So the puzzles were the trap. The puzzles. 
this up there. And the other statue was here to disarm the trap. Now that you've disarmed it, we should be all right. I'll just lead a bunch of these kids into the soul sanctum, into this giant dangerous world, yes. and leave them all alone. See you later. <laughs> He's like, quick, keep pushing stuff around and see what happens. I'll go someplace safe. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's a horrible old man. One of my favorite things in anime, though, which it just reminded me of, is like, um, Naruto's a great example. It's like, oh, I have this super demon. I need to find some way to hide it. It's like, I'll put it in my son. <laughs> really? Yeah. You cursed your son? There's no alternative. <laughs> Alright, I think I have to go down now. Um, it's the same as, like, in, in some movies and stuff where they're like, Oh, our village is getting raided by marauders and they want this magical amulet. I'll put it on my baby and float him down the stream so they hunt him for his life. <laughs> Thanks yeah. for dooming your children. Well, if you put a, if you put faith in a higher being, I mean, it, everything might 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 come all out all right, right? That's, how, that's how Moses happened, right? Maybe. I mean, was that Moses? Or was that... I don't know. Am I thinking... Of, no, no, okay. Sometimes I'll get uh, Noah and Moses mixed up. Yeah, I do that too. Um, I'm not especially religious, but I know they both have to do with water. Yeah, Noah, <laughs> Noah was the one with the ark, uh -huh. because the world was destroyed by yes, water. flood. And uh, Moses was the one who was floated down the Nile to, uh, basically the people that was trying to kill him. Yeah, he split the they, water. And they were adopted him. Uh-huh. Alright, what were we supposed to do here? I wasn't paying attention supposed to look right here. Three seconds. Because something's happening. That makes sense. Ah! This has to be it! <laughs> Let's go, Ron! Like, All right. It's fun having good conversations, but I feel bad because I missed a couple pieces well, of important I'm, I'm leaving it on the screen. I know, so I know. If people That's are like, fine. super interested, they can read yeah. it and That's they cool. can listen to us ramble. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Just like right there. Uh huh. Sure. Wait for me! <laughs> <laughs> ah! Beam me up, Scotty. Pretty sure. Pretty sure this world is not Star Trek. No, but they beamed him somewhere. <laughs> Some Teleport portal. Teleported, right? Yep. Oh, now we have the, the ability to split up. A little bit. <laughs> I'm scared. <laughs> what are you looking at me for? <laughs> Where are we? Oh my god, it's you, old man. I thought you were dead. That sure would be convenient. Ah! <laughs> this is a wonderful place. Is that the ocean? I guess they don't see the ocean here. Yeah, well, they're actually pretty close, but they have to cross, like, a lot of mountains They have to, get to cross a whole continent, and this so this is an old man, basically. No, when you get out to the world map, I'm pretty sure they're, like, right on the coast, pretty much, but there's, like, a big mountain range that actually blocks them off from it. Yeah, but, yeah, you'd have but to yeah, go over the mountains. Uh-huh, point is that it's it's not especially easy to see the sea, even though they're pretty close to it. Maybe he's stayed here his whole life. He hasn't been in the I don't explorer. know about that. I feel like people out... He's, study he's just here studying alchemy. He must have spent a lot of time. Not, no, he doesn't have a wife. He doesn't have kids or anything. Yeah, but I think I think later on in the game you meet people who have met Creighton. Maybe I know in the second one, um, he kind of tags along, and he's always like the one that's like, "Oh my god!" <laughs> I think they might have actually mentioned also that he actually doesn't have synergy. I don't think he's actually from this place. No, he he just studies it under, yeah. the, ma under the mountain. So he's probably not from here. It's a possibility, I guess, but he's acting like he's never seen an ocean. Also, we're, we're skipping all this exposition. Well, I'm, I mean, it's fine. This is a lot of exposition. We both played this game. Yeah. I mean, we don't have to speak every single line. I mean, I gotta get my voice to rest sometimes, right? <laughs> no. Never. No? You want me to go all, all at once? <laughs> the Venusaur! The Venusaur! Yeah, this is where he's talking. <laughs> I'll catch you! <laughs> this is where he's talking about. Crane uh... pulls out a Pokeball and throws <laughs> it at the statue. He's like, ah! <laughs> <laughs> And then later he'll meet some kids and say, I only have these three. Let's see, this is the Sine Joan of Fire, Water, Wind, and I forget the other one. <laughs> it's sitting right there in his back pocket. So like, I can't seem to tell if you're a boy or a girl. Because <laughs> he's so old. Haven't I told you this before? <laughs> yes. <laughs> What? I must have fallen asleep then, because I don't have a clue what he's talking about. Let's talk about the ocean, Bron. <laughs> the Wisdom Stone, the Stone of the Sages. What's the ocean? 
This stone dominates everything. It can transmutate screwed matter into gold and even thwart. Is that the Philosopher's Stone? Yeah, basically. Do you understand now? Of course! <laughs> the study of alchemy began with the search of this very stone. Don't really get how it works, but they have an enormous power, right? Beyond enormous! With a single gem, one could conquer the world! Now perhaps, you might begin to understand the we severity of what we're trying to find. Hey Ron, we should take all four. <laughs> <laughs> Don't scare us like that, Creighton. I totally thought you were serious. <laughs> Conquering the world. Says a guy with evil background thoughts. <laughs> <laughs> well, who can say what the truth is? Jim's like, I can see what you're thinking, Ron. <laughs> <laughs> Like, I'm attracted to power. <laughs> <laughs> That's why I've been searching for the elemental stars to seek and learn the truth about these stones. But I'm an old man and I must fall. <laughs> Ooh, oh! <laughs> so he's so old. He is pretty old. <laughs> Be careful, Creighton. It looks slippery. You should let us kids, who are probably like 12 years old, do all the hard work. I think we're 17 now. I are covered we? that earlier. Oh, oh, that's right. That's right. It was 12 before. Uh -huh. Make the boys do it. Or I think they were 14 <laughs> before, and we were talking about how they looked like they'd be older than 14. Oh, uh, Jenna's ditching or younger us. Younger than 14. Oh, I couldn't. Please. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, she says, make the boys do it. We'll be glad to get the stones for you, right, Ron? Yeah, let's make Bron do it. <laughs> <laughs> Fine, I'll go conquer the world. John looks at Braun, winks, and he's like, Alright, let's do this. <laughs> <laughs> I'm in. Well, watch out, old man! <laughs> he's about to fall off all over again. What are those bags? These are made of woven threads of mithril. Don't ask where I got it. I had to do some horrible things. I prepared them just for this special occasion. Now go fetch those stars and put them in the bags. And be sure to wear gloves when you hold them. Oh, that's what he grabbed a few episodes ago. Yeah. Yeah, they look like pots That's almost and pans, like he right? expected to find this. Oh, wait, I have to do it first. Yeah, there's like an order to him for some reason. Burp. Uh, I think it was this one. Um, Maybe not. Hold on, keep going right. Right? No, that's the, a, the path that's branches, enough. though. Let's like, see, it keeps going. Maybe? Maybe? Yeah. Hey! Yay! We got the first elemental stone! Woo! Na, 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 na. Incidentally, it's Venus Star! <laughs> I'm gonna teach it Vine Whip! <laughs> I think we get a Vine Whip later. Sort no, of. Solar Beam is the best of all! What are you talking about, man? Vine Whip can beat Solar Beam any day. Why well, now you're getting real nerdy. What's wrong with Pokemon? Oh, I'm excited Pokemon. to play the new one. I haven't played it yet. I've been keeping it for like a week. <laughs> uh -huh. I bought it the day it came out, but I've been keeping it because I'm taking a long plane ride later. Yeah. And I want that to be like my first experience. And I can just play okay. like four sure. or five hours Pokemon straight. Yeah. By the time this comes out, it'll be like a month past yeah. Sun and Moon's well, release. This is, as of right now, I'm excited about Pokemon. Yeah, cool. Because I've heard a lot of good things about this new one. Yeah, I've heard some people talking about it. It was kind of funny because like I didn't really care. Um... I didn't really look into it, and nothing I heard about it really excited me. Uh, and so I didn't care a whole lot. And then we got to, um... Go up or down? Um, I'm not sure. I think... Uh, I think it's just this other one over here. You already went down. I know, but then another one popped up, right? Uh, oh, that was on the other side. That was the other one that created yeah. was about to fall down. Mm -hmm. Um... Yeah, so I didn't really care about the new Pokemon games, but... Then, like, they came out, and suddenly everybody got a copy. And I was like, nobody even talked about this among my friends. Like, <laughs> suddenly everybody's got one. Yeah, no, it's apparently a really uh, big deal, because mm -hmm. they're switching a bunch around in it, and, yep. like, making it accessible to the old players, but also accessible to the new ones. Mm -hmm. So I'm excited to try it out. All uh, right. Maybe, uh, maybe I'll bring it up on the show later. Yeah, well, maybe. Uh, but for now, I think it's a good time for next time on Operation Pixel. But we're about to get the last stone! But Say it's it. going to have to wait. Say it. Say it. What? Give me the stone. Give, give, me, <laughs> give me the stone. Well, hold on. 
Give me the stone. Because someone's about to say that, I think. <laughs> oh no! We got something happening right. next time with so, Operation Pixel! Yep, we'll be back to see how this resolves.